may think after given many opportunities to speak publicly, I would no longer grow nervous. <laughs> but I do, so you'll have to bear with me. <coughs> As a young, shy, one-handed, self-conscious ninth grade Chris Sobal, I never dreamed of being granted the title Homecoming King 2014. But here I am, standing before you, privileged to have received this honor. I would have never been able to achieve the goals I have and become the person I am today without the support and love of many wonderful people. First, I would like to thank Frank and Mary for all they have provided me with these past couple years. I am very blessed and grateful to have become a part of their family. They have supported me in everything I do and always believed in me. And without them, I wouldn't be in the school that I take so much pride in. Thank you to my coaches for continuing to inspire me not only as a player, but as a person. You all have taught me to strive to be the best I can be and love each sport I play that much more. I'd also like to thank my teachers for putting up with me day after day. Many of them could tell you that's not an easy task. I'd like to thank the entire Bab family for allowing me to spend so much time with you and be a part of your crazy world. Dealing with my immature behavior can be tough, but without your support, love, and generosity, I don't know where I would be. I also can't forget to thank all my friends and peers for voting for me to represent them as their king. You guys have made my high school experience some of the best years of my life. And last but not least, a huge thank you to all you ladies out there for not drooling over my good looks all the time. <laughs> I know that can't be easy either. <laughs> Springs will always hold a special place in my heart. No matter where I go in life, I will always remember and cherish the time I have spent here. So many memories have been made like super fanning at sport events, performing at homecoming assemblies, and playing sports with my brothers, and many others. I feel very lucky to have had the opportunity to be a part of such a close-knit and caring community. I'm not gonna lie, Coming to the school for the first time, I was very scared. <laughs> Having one hand, I had to worry about fitting in. How will people react? Will I ever make friends? Will I be as accepted as an equal? I was very shy and always walked around with my nub in my pocket. Looking back now, I feel extremely silly for having these fears. I was accepted right away by everyone and they made me feel right at home. I can't thank you all enough for that. I've grown as a person and came a long way since I first set foot into Cambridge Springs. This wonderful school and community has taught me a lot and has made me a better person. Like I mentioned before, it's hard to wrap my head around the fact that I came here what seems like four short years ago. And now I'm saying my final remarks as your king. There are so many other candidates who deserve to win as much as I do as much as I did. Well, except maybe Hunter, because he's always been a chum. <laughs> the fact that I was chosen, though, gives me a feeling that's hard to put into words. I'd just like to say thank you one more time. It has been an amazing opportunity. As I wrap up, I'd like to just leave you with some advice that I believe in strongly. First, the next lucky gentlemen who are receiving the title of Homecoming King. Whoever you may be, don't take this opportunity for granted. You have been chosen to represent your classmates, and that is a great honor. Enjoy it as much as you can, for as long as you can, because before you know it, you'll be where I am passing it down. And to everyone else, make the most of your high school career. Get involved and make lots of memories, because in the blink of an eye, it's over. The final piece of advice I'd like to give is something I've lived by my whole life. And that is, always stay true to yourself. No matter what obstacles you face, if you keep a positive attitude, work hard, and put everything you have into whatever you're trying to accomplish, good things will happen. Thank you for your time.